What can you wish for me now? Hmm. Well, maybe later. Wish for me that. You got it, Sunny Boy. The very hungry caterpillar eats snacks. An opposites book from the world of Eric Carl. It's snack time. Can the very hungry caterpillar eat snacks that are opposite from each other? He sure can. For a special treat, how about a bite of this small cupcake and big cake? Mmm, yummy! Yum! Cheese and crackers. The crackers are hard, and the cheese is soft. He nibbles his way through both. Would you like some too? Yes, I would. Are these snacks opposites? Yes. The orange is solid, but the orange juice is liquid. Which would you like to try? I want the orange juice. These pickles are bumpy. How about this apple? It's smooth. Did the very hungry caterpillar try them both? Of course. Oh no! What's happening to this popsicle? It was frozen, but now it's melted. How about another snack instead? Yes! Look, grapes and peanuts. One snack is sweet, the other is salty. He has some of each. Which do you like better, sweet or salty? Which do you like better, sweet or salty? I like sweet better. How about a chewy cookie or a crunchy carrot? He tries both. If he's still hungry, what else can he eat here that's crunchy? Patchel. What about Chewy? Cherry beans are Chewy. That's one short tangerine and one tall pineapple, but they're both delicious. Mmm! This treat is extra special: a warm slice of cherry pie and a scoop of cold ice cream make a tasty combo. Would you like a bite? Yes, I would. The very hungry caterpillar found so many opposites, but there's still one more. What's the opposite of snacking alone? Snacking together with friends. What would you like for a snack? I like pickle. The end. We liked it. It was great. Bye. See you later. Peach, why can't you cry? Oh, don't forget! Hit the, the bell. bell.